New tonight, surveillance video of a hit and run that left a Tulsa woman fighting for her life. Two News reporter Vincent Hill is at 18th and Garnett where the accident happened. He has more information for us right now. Vincent. Yeah, screaming in terror is how witnesses described the hit and run that happened last night around 1030 that even knocked the woman out of her shoes. Now a nearby restaurant shared some surveillance video with us. We won't show you the victim getting hit, but we will show you the car that police are now searching for. It was almost closing time for Naomi Perez when she heard a crash. I thought it was two cars. It was like loud, really, really loud. It was a scary moment for her and her customers. Everybody was screaming. But it wasn't two cars. It was a lady hit so hard by a car, it knocked her out of her shoes. Two News obtained this surveillance video from a nearby business. It captured the moment a white car hit the woman, something we've chosen not to show here. I just screamed. It's, it's, it's dead. Or th that's why I said, like. Uh, that's why I could went to my mind. Naomi and the customers can be seen rushing to help the woman. And I saw the body. She was, you know, like bleeding and and she couldn't even uh, say anything. And she says the woman was in grave condition. She was just not even trying to move or anything, anything at all. Tulsa police are now investigating. The last update that we got, she is uh, in the hospital, in the local hospital with injuries, with major injuries to her head. On her torso area and her leg. Officer Danny Bean says they're looking to talk to that driver. We need we need to know, you know, what happened, that side of the story from that driver, and we need to put this together. But whatever their side of the story is, the driver is facing serious charges once they are caught. Leaving the scene of an accident is a serious crime, um, but this is leaving the scene of a potentially deadly accident, but certainly with great bodily harm already. Now, Perez says in recent months, speeding and drag racing have gotten out of control up and down this street. Meanwhile, Tulsa police are asking anyone that may have seen anything, especially if you have a license plate, to call Crime Stoppers. In Tulsa, Vincent Hill, 2 News.